Well, the new James Bond movie, Skyfall, comes out on Friday, and Bond always has the coolest gadgets, usually provided to him by uh, the, the mad scientist guy Q, although I believe it's R in the more recent movies now. But uh, Julian Sanders from London Drugs is our own personal Q outfitter, and he's brought some really cool gadgets with him today. Good morning. Morning. So uh, let's take a look at this. This is a very interesting piece, something fairly unique. It's, it's a laptop computer but it, it has ha fallen on some hard times. That's right, yeah, it's a Panasonic <laughs> Tough Book, and uh, these guys can take a bullet. So James Bond's laptop, when he needs to use it, that would be the one. So this was something that was used in a heated gunfight, and it took a shot, and you, it even went out the back, you can see a little bit. It, it, Unbelievable. It, uh, the true story, unfortunately, is a little bit more boring. A uh, uh, police officer was cleaning his gun while he was using the computer <laughs> and course. an accidental discharge. But well, they just popped the hard drive out, all the data survived. Well, we can't all be James Bond, but still, very <laughs> interesting piece. It's called a, what, a Panasonic Tough Book? You got it, yep. Yeah, certainly is. Uh, next, I have this little pen here. And this is no ordinary pen, though. No. Nope. This has uh, a few very interesting features. This guy's a uh, video camera, so there's uh, right, right, right at the, there, hey? right. That's the button to turn it on, and then right up here. So when you have it sticking in your pocket, there's oh, a I see. So tiny we, little. Uh, we click uh, it, and it's uh, it's actually not a bad resolution. It's got uh, four gigs of storage, so you can record a few hours. And uh, it even comes with the easy ability to to plug it right in. You USB got it, yeah. drive right there. So very, very cool. <laughs> Uh, something you just put in your pocket, and away you go. Yep. Right? Very you got neat. It. Uh, another small camera here. This is what is it? Nikon Cool Pick. Yeah, that's the S01. It's so small you can hide it uh, in any pocket, any little uh, place you've got, and uh, it's a 10 megapixel, and uh, you wow. can see it's. Uh, uh, about half the size of your hands, so really? it's uh, three times zoom. So I can do one of these and walk around. Yep, absolutely. Yep. Pictures and <laughs> being generally creepy. <laughs> uh, this is another camera here. Uh, looks like you can mount it on the dashboard. You got it. Yeah. So if you flip it up the other way, uh, the suction cup just goes on your dashboard, and then the front there. She's got oh, okay, a night vision camera, so it records when your vehicle's moving, and then you take it home, plug it in your car, and you've got uh, all the video you want. Night vision. <laughs> Imagine that in the 1960s. Yeah, uh, I, I can't even, can't even. Um, miniaturization is something, with this this pen camera, uh, something that you see a lot in Bond films. It used to be always uh, hiding the microfilm. Exactly, right? yeah. And you are telling me this is the new version of that? Yeah, that's a, a padlocked flash drive, and the other mm. tiny one is a 32 gig flash this drive. This is 32 gigs. <laughs> so that could hold about 32 billion uh, text files on it if so you wanted it to. I could swallow it if I ever needed to, exactly. to dispose of it in a hurry <laughs> and then retrieve it later. Gross. Uh, these are a couple of uh, surveillance, uh, little helicopters here, uh, controlled by uh, like a PlayStation controller. What does this one do? Uh, that one's got a, a video camera in it, so it records onto tiny little micro SD cards. Wow. It's so espionage. Uh, you can cover out the whole area, take it back, and then you've got your layout. Nice. And then this smaller one here? That tiny guy has uh, the ability to shoot water. At least that's what it's designed what? to. But I'm sure James Bond would have a different use for it other than water. <laughs> oh, yeah. Right. I can only imagine. Very, very cool, Julian. Thank you so much. Uh, London Drugs, your own personal Q outfitters here got it. in this, this season of James Bond. Uh, when we come back, we'll get you dressed up like James Bond. Stay with us.